favorite, my personal favorite is the Canada one because it's a classic. Like as a, I like things to be classic, ordinary, like normal ones. And this is, I think, most. I think it's probably the best seller here. So, girls, how are you gonna top the, you gonna top the best seller? <laughs> he's, got, he's, got, he's got a point in the sense that if if more people buy more of this product, then he's got a case it. However, the lady, the best. However, though, if there's anything I've learned, buddy, is that you can have all the logic and numbers and facts on your side. If you're arguing against a, a lady, you don't have great chances. If you're arguing against two, you've already lost before this before this started. So as much as I agree with you with a pen, though, let's go to the ladies. Let's go to Pamela and see what her favorite is. I have to agree with you, Nico. I think Richard is the winner. Oh, I, I knew before we even started. I knew as soon as Richard walked in the door, I was like, that's the guy who looks like he'll lose an argument. So what I really like about this drink, it's called Salty Cream Strawberry, is that it tastes like strawberry ice cream. It actually tastes like strawberry ice cream, and it's both fruity and creamy at the same time, which I feel like is perfect for the summer season. And yeah, I feel like and Richard's gonna lose to this drink. So and, all right. and someone with a sweet tooth like you as yeah. well. This this one, it seems like it's it's tailor it's tailor made tailor for made someone for like you. With sweet tooth like you. All right, maybe, hey, you know, that she makes a good case. That might be next month's bestseller. Camille, you have, you have your, your own argument. Yeah, so mine actually looks different compared to theirs. Mine is the passion fruit tea, tea, wait, hold on. Passion, passion fruit tea burst drink. So this is my favorite, actually, because it's very light as compared to theirs. Theirs is creamier, mine is lighter, so definitely I think it's the drink for summer because you don't want anything too, like, too creamy and too heavy. So yeah, and then also I think this makes everyone super sexy. Because, you know, sexy. <laughs> <laughs> she, went, she went with a sexy argument and expects me not to agree. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing to me. No, I, I, I don't know why I fit you guys against each other, but all of you guys make such great cases. You know, I, I think it really does fit a certain type of personality, a certain type of taste. And I think the, the drinks that you guys have chosen really, you know, matches you guys um, in, in a certain way. Now, you know, we've been talking about um, about how cocoa tea has really become such such a huge player in the Philippines over the last four years. Such great success. What about the brand? We know how much you guys like the product, but what about the brand that you guys, you know, love so much? Whether it's you know walking into the store, whether it's the ingredients that they use. What what about it really made you feel so strong about you know representing this brand, Camille? Well, personally, I'm very visual, so I like that all the stores are very um, visually pleasing. You know, that everything's so well put together. Every corner is Instagramable. You know, we live in a social media age, so I think that's one of the things that I really like because it's a it's a it's a complete experience. I have to agree with Camille. I'm always on Instagram, and I find it very important for somewhere you want to hang out to be very Instagramable, for it to have cute colors and all that. And also their drinks are delicious, so yeah, two birds in one stone. <laughs> Richard, go ahead. Well, I don't want to argue the girls anymore. So. <laughs> <laughs> quick, what a quick study. What a quick study you are. Uh, you, you know, that's right. And that's what me and Richard are doing there in the corner. Also, we're making sure we're getting our Instagram stories in. Yeah. Um, you know, but you know, we're, we're we're very happy that you guys um, are representing um, Coco and you know, I think it's it's also so perfect that the three of you, while so very different, are there's also something that brings all of you together and your, your personality. Uh, making your, your taste, obviously, in, in the drinks. And I, I think I want to ask the question that uh, a lot of people who may be walking into the store for the first time or seeing it for the first time or trying the drinks for the first time, they're naturally going to ask, right? What makes it different? I'm sure you guys have tried out other Milty products before, and you know, hey, props to them, right? But you guys have, have tried this, and you guys feel so strongly about this being your favorite, and have chosen to represent this brand. What sets it apart for you guys? Well, for me, the, like I said earlier, pan, the panel the pan is my favorite because there's the mini pros. I think they call it the white pros, which is basically sago. And sago is not my favorite. Um, what do you call that? Topic? Yeah, topic. Very cool. And having that with the, or the normal pros, the, the big pros, are like, it's a perfect mixture. So that's why I love this very, very much. And of course, like I said, like you said, like everyone said earlier, like this place gives out, gives out a very happy vibe, a very Instagramable vibe. And of course, yeah, that makes everything together, which makes it perfect. 